You said you're excited about them. You want to know what I'm excited about? That. Memorial Coliseum. Yeah. That's yeah. Memorial Coliseum is going to be electric, electric next season, man. What I know you probably, I don't know if you know what it's going to look like. I don't know. Did you get a chance to check out the gym or anything like that? I, I, I coached here uh, against Kentucky yeah. uh, probably like in 2000 and uh, maybe eight. Yeah. Uh, and even then I thought great arena, probably a little bit tired. And, uh, and getting a little so, old, yeah, yeah, getting a little bit older. Has that uh, historical feel, historic, though? Historic, great, great atmosphere, great history. Uh, but then when I heard that they were uh, remodeling it, that for was, you, that was, that was <laughs> yeah, I, that, that was one of the things that really lured me in. Yeah. You know, it lured me in. I'm like, man, they're going to have a nice, you know, uh, home court advantage because you know some some arenas are really good. Uh, and we were fortunate enough at Virginia Tech where we got to the point where we were selling it out. Oh, wow. fantastic 9,000 people fantastic atmosphere for women's basketball but if you don't sell it out it can feel a little empty yeah and uh we used to go to nc state and they they just they uh, remodeled uh reynolds coliseum historic you know oh wow and it was it, i always thought it was the perfect arena for yeah. women's basketball yeah now with memorials you know uh remodeling i i think it's going to be exactly the same you, know, you had the history, uh, you know, you, you got you, you put a couple bells and whistles around it and uh, and then you add the history to it. Exactly. It has that good yeah, blend. It's, it's going to be it's going to be a tremendous, tremendous selling point for us. Uh, we just redid. We're sitting in this beautiful. It's uh, amazing. Beautiful. Beautiful. It's amazing. Film room. Uh, almost too nice. You know, they're going to sit here and they might be, you know, sleep watching. Take a nap. Um, yeah. <laughs> but you go across the hall and the, uh, the locker room is one of the best locker rooms I've ever seen. Yeah. So in this day and age, you need that. You need that, and uh, because you, you have to be able to be in the game, you can't have a an older space that they're going to be living in, and then they go somewhere else and they see a newer space. space. And yeah, you know, that, those are those are those can be some deciding factors. So excited about the the whole remodeling situation, and uh, I think that's going to be you know something that's going to help us. Camera's right on you. I'm putting you on the spot, Brooks. Uh -oh. Tell Big Blue Nation what they can expect when they go into Memorial Coliseum for their game day experience. Um, you know, I think what you're going to expect, uh, you, you're going to come to expect the kids, first and foremost, they're going to give their, their utmost effort. Uh, that's going to uh, relate to excitement. Uh, there's going to relate to a, a, a camaraderie. You're going to feel connected with the kids. And uh, when you feel connected like that, I always say a good home court can make a good team great. And I think with the support that we're going to get, you know, everyone's going to have a wonderful experience. And, and uh, Memorial, uh, that's going to generate, you know, a few more points for us again, you know, and, yeah. and tough SEC, you're going to need every point you can get. So I think that this is going to be a tremendous, tremendous family atmosphere. It's going to be a lot of fun. Uh, and I think it's going to be a lot of memories made. So, you know, come on out, bring a friend, tell your friend to bring a friend, so on and so forth. And I think that's going to be, it can be one of the best uh, home court advantages for women's basketball.